a block M of mass M kilograms is attached to a beam up P and Q. So we've got a block M is attached to this beam up P and Q by two light strings. M hangs in equilibrium with MP, MP and MQ making angles of 25 degrees and 40 respectively to the upward vertical. Given that the tension in MQ is 8 newtons, find the value of the tension in MP, find the value of the mass of the weight, little m. Okay, so the important thing is the block is in equilibrium. If we draw a diagram, and you should draw a diagram and start levelling in the forces, we know this is 8 newtons. We have a force acting downwards here, which is mg newtons, which is the weight of the block. And then we have a tension acting upwards here, which we're going to call T newtons. Right, now if we uh, resolve the forces horizontally, first of all, these, uh, this, these, this tension in here and this force here can be split up into two components. The component of this one, the horizontal component of this one is this line here, and that will be 8 sine 40 newtons using our trigonometry. So we have 8 sine 40 acting in that direction, acting in the opposite direction, we're going to have T sine 25 newtons, so minus T sine 25, and that's equal to zero because the whole thing is in equilibrium. Rearranging that, we're going to have that 8 sine 40 is equal to T sine 25, and therefore T will be 8 sine 40 over sine 25, which we can do in our calculator, make sure our calculator is in degree mode. And we're going to get 12.167, which is equal to 12.2 newtons. Now, we should keep this long answer in our calculator for the next part of the calculation, which is to calculate the value of the mass. So, to calculate the value of the mass, we will need to resolve vertically. So, the, what this, this, this force here will be equivalent to this force here, and this force here will be equivalent to this force here, except they will have uh, slightly different angles. So... This one will be T cos 25 newtons using our trigonometry. So T cos 25, and this one will be 8 cos 40. This one acting here. And then acting downwards will be at mg. So we'll need to take away mg, and that's then in equal to zero because it's in equilibrium. Uh, carrying that on over here. We know that T is 12.1677 newtons from, from the previous part. Rearranging, we've got T cos 25 plus 8 cos 40 is equal to mg. And therefore, m will be T cos 25 plus 8 cos 40 divided by g. Now, instead of T, if we press the answer in our calculator, the answer function, normally shift is on answer, or minus on the above the minus sign, it's a Casio. Then we're going to uh, put that number in there, 12.16 of the calculate there, time cos 25 plus 8 cos 40, all divided by g, g being 9.8 metres per second squared. That will give you 1.7506. Rounded off to three significant figures, will be 1.75 kilograms. And there is the diagram for your reference. OK, so this has been a video to show you how to find the tension in the string and the mass of a block suspended by two strings from a beam. I hope you understood and I thank you very much for watching.